Hold on. Jimmy and I, I want to tell y'all something. First of all, Nuwapian is not a religion. Sabian is not a religion. It's a culture. It's a people. Okay? Just like Jews are not a religion. Jews are saying that they're Jews or Jewish or Israelites are calling themselves. It, well, no. Israelites are religion. But Nuwapian is a culture. It's how the way that you do your hair, the way that your voice box sounds, the color of your skin. That's what Nuwapian, a.k.a. Sabian, signifies. It doesn't signify religion. We only got two minutes. What is Nuwapu? Nuwapu is pronounced Nuwapu. The meaning of the word Nuwapu is the knowledge, wisdom, and understanding. Nuwapu is all knowledge, all wisdom, all understanding, finite and infinite. Nuwapu is the science of sciences and the science in sciences. Nuwapu is a spiritual science that existed before the great flood of Noah 17,250,000 years ago and is therefore the science of the original creative forces and the original spiritual science of the African Pygmies and Ethiopians in general. Nuwapu is the science in which and with which the universe was grown. Nuwapu existed for a long time after the flood but, gave, but finally gave way to pantheism in accordance with the time cycle laws of nature. Just as in accord with the time cycles of nature, Pantheism eventually gave way to religion as we know it today. Now it is time for Nuwapu again. Therefore, Nuwapu is the spiritual science of all woolly haired people. However, like all other races, our race has members who are unintelligent. And if the unintelligent members of the Ethiopian race seem to be more in number proportion than in other races, is, it is because of the adverse forces of the moon cycle, the worst cycle on the circle for woolly-haired people. True mental cosmic peace, my name is Tal Nunet Nubaha Nupu, and I'm just making it known. Yeah.